three, two, one, go. Hello everyone. For past three months at MLS Fellowship, I worked on WebXR Samples project where I created immersive VR experiences on web using WebXR and 3JS. So let's proceed with the demo. Here is the WebXR sample project. The previous fellows had worked on the layer samples while we were more focused on hand interactions. Uh, let's start with the first example here. Uh, WebXR hand input API gives us the positions of our hands and by implementing those using Trezius, we were mainly focused on hand gestures and hand interaction. Here is the first example. This is the basic example where we can see our hands. So this is the baseline for our all other examples. Now let's see our other examples. Here's your second example, drawing space. This example, we are considering the position of joints of our hands. And by considering those, we can actually draw. So while pinching, I can draw. I can draw anything here. Here I am drawing M, L, H. So I can just draw, draw basically anything here. And it's very, very interesting. This one is. So yeah, so that's it. And uh, for our third example, we have here touch sphere. Up until now, we were only considering the positions of our hand. In touch sphere, we are also considering the positions of the treasures objects. So by pinching here, I can create some of the spheres, some of the mini spheres I can create here. And by touching them with my different fingers, I can change their color like this. Like that. Going into our third example, sorry, uh, fourth example, we have here grab sphere. Here we are not only considering the positions of previous objects, but we are also changing them. So as we can see, I can create some of the spheres here uh, by pinching, and now with my left hand, I can grab and change their positions. Let's go into the next example. The next one is draw and erase in 3D. It is basically same as the um, second example where we can draw in the 3D space using our hand. And not only we can draw, we can also erase what we have drawn. So this is basically our this draw and erase example. For next example, up until now we, we are only considering one hand interaction at a time. The resize object with hand consider uh, two hand interaction. For example, we can see a sphere here. So with my two hands, I can resize this sphere like this. I can make it small, I can make it big. I can basically resize this sphere. This is for the two hand interaction. Coming to our seventh example, the Spider-Man one. We were thinking of doing something fun and what could be more fun than the Spider-Man pose and saying go wave go. Okay, we don't need to say that, but if we just do the Spider-Man pose, then we can just basically show the wave with our hand like this. Yep. So when we are talking about and Spider-Man is good um, and good and bad are the two sides of a same coin. And when we are talking about heroes, we have to talk about the villains. So when we are talking about villains, this one is inevitable. That's why we made the tennis example. What we can do in this tennis example is using my left hand, I can create some spheres. So here I'm creating spheres of random color using the pinch detection of my left hand. So I have created some spheres here. Now using my right hand, if I snap, half of the spheres are gone. I snap again, again gone. Let me create some more spheres again. So I snap, 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 snap. 
and we even named the function that uh, does this as Thanos. So it was really, very, it was very, very fun to do this one. So this has been an incredible experience learning WebXR and building um, immersive VR experiences for web. Thank you, MLS, and thank you, Facebook, for this incredible experience. Thank you.